Question number 8. To find the range of the values of k for which the quadratic equation has no real root. The condition for the real root, same root, virtual root is first you have to find b square minus 4ac. If it is equal to 0, it means it has a real root. Greater than 0, real root. Equal to 0 is equal roots also, real and equal. And less than 0 is no real roots. So we will apply this condition here. P square minus 4ac is less than 0. And it is for the standard equation ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0. Now here a is equal to k, b is equal to 8 and c is equal to 2 k plus 7. These are the values of a, b and c. We will apply here. b square means 8 square minus 4. a is k and c is 2k plus 7 64 minus 2 and 4 8k 8k multiply k is 8k square and 8k times 7 minus 56 k is less than 0. This is another quadratic equation. So let's say 8k square plus 56k minus 64 is equal to 0. Divide all sides by all by 8. So the equation is going to reduce to k square plus 7k minus 8 is equal to 0. So it can be written as k square plus 8k minus k minus 8 is equal to 0. So k common k plus 8 minus 1 common k plus 8 is equal to 0. So we can say that k minus 1 and k plus 8. So critical value of k will be 1 and negative 8. If I draw this this is 1 and this is negative 8. Question says find the range. Range is the y value. So these are the critical values 1 and 8. Now equation was this and we have written it this. So we have So this is uh, our equation was minus k square minus 7k plus 8 is less than 0. So we made it k square plus 7k minus 8. So this is greater than 0. So this is this was our greater than 0 means y values. So y values is the positive y value. So our answer is this. This values of y. So the solution is k is greater than 8 and k is 
less than negative 1. You should have done this part here. You should have written it minus. This is plus 8k square plus 56k minus 64 square root of 0. Question number 9. In the first month after opening, a mobile phone shop sold 300 phones. A model for future sale assumed that the number of phones sold will increase 5% per month. So that 300 multiply 1.05 will be sold in the second month. 300 multiply 1.05 square in the third month and so on. In fact, this question is a solution. Now these days they don't give you this. They just tell you 5% per month. So it means the second term is 300 multiply 1. Per, if it increases, if decreases, then this number will be 0 0.95. Number of phones sold in 24 months. So first month, They sold 300. Second month, 300, 1.05 is to the power 2 minus 1. Third month, 300, 1.05 is to the power. 3 minus 1 this is the third month so 24 months 24th month it will be 300 1.05 is to the power 24 minus 1 you remember this so that is equal to 921 phones the total number of phones sold over 24 months so this is part a part b we have a is equal to 300 r is equal to 1.05 and n is equal to 24 so sn will be a 1 minus r is to the power n over 1 minus r Here we can see that R is greater than 1. So don't write it like this. You write it like S24 or SN is equal to 300. 1.05 is to the power N minus 1 over 1.05 minus 1. Because this R is greater than 1. We use this formula. If it is less than 1, we use this formula. So it is one, three, three, five, one number of phones. The model predicts that nth month, the number of phones sold in that month exceeds three thousand for the first time. What is the value of n? Suppose this is a particular month, say this is and nth month it is already given so that is a r to the power n minus 1 will be greater than 3000 so a is 300 r is 1.05 
the power n minus 1 is greater than 3000. So 1.05 n minus 1 is greater than 10. Taking log, this will become n minus 1 log 1.05 is greater than log 10. So that is n log 1.05 minus log 1.05 is greater than log 10. You can solve with this. I, I think you can also solve it here only. Divided by this anyway. So n log 1.05 is greater than log this plus this. So it's log. So this will be log 10.5. So n will be n will be greater than log ten point five over log one point zero five. So this value is forty eight point one nine. So n is greater than forty eight point one nine, so that is 49. This question can be solved directly here, so you will get this 47 plus 148.19. The curve C is equation y is equal let's say this is a coordinate, this is b, this one is c. So a, b, and c. The coordinate is x is 0 and y is 1. B coordinate is x is pi over 2 and y is 0. And C coordinate is x is 3 pi over 2 and this is 0. This is also another coordinate D that is 2. That is 1 and 0. This is shifting toward this. This means it is affecting only x-axis plus pi by 3. So this is plus pi over 3. So coordinate will be pi over 3 and 1. Plus pi over 3. So that is 5 pi over 6. And plus pi over 3. Three over two plus one over three. That is six nine plus two. Eleven over six. So these are the three coordinates. So pi over 3 and 1, this is pi over 2, so pi over 3 will be here, b coordinate will be 5 pi over 6, so this coordinate will shift here, So this is the graph and it's asking the exact coordinates. So these are the exact coordinates. Part C. Solve for x. So we have cos x minus pi over 3. We can write it as uh, is equal to cos inverse 1 over root 2. So x minus pi over 3 is equal to 
so this is 45 degree 45 degree means this is pi over pi over 4 this is 45 degree a s t c so one is angle this and another one is angle this so this angle will be 315 